Oh, I don't like this. I've I know about this place, but I've never been here. Shaded Citadel. Yep. This is exactly what I feared. Oh Jesus. I hear music. Whoa, what the no, 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 no. No, no. Friend. Memories. Stuff. I need more of those? I need to go to another blue person? To get more of them? Hello and welcome back to Rain World. I'm Arima and we are recording live today again and we're going to go back in where we left off shortly after speaking to a strange friend in a place named Looks to the Moon. Um, I have no food, but there's a thing that I'd like to do and I need food for it. So that's actually going to be our first goal today. Death counter? We did forget uh, to add some deaths, so the death counter has been updated to the proper number of five. And I have a goal list now. My goals are to explore and to learn to talk. Um, I actually want to do something called a passage, which is basically like, let go of me. Let, let, this, this, you can't see it very well, but it's trying to, don't, don't you dare drown me. Come on, let, let go of me. Are you effing kidding me? Oh my gosh. I can't believe... I can't believe 10 seconds into the freaking stream. Ah. Uh. Well, hey, I can pass it now because I died. Ironically, uh, I wanted the rest, but that's okay. Survivor. So we are going to go to, not Shoreline, that's where we were. Not Shaded Citadel, that's where we will never return to in our entire life. I got at least one confirmation in chat that it's Industrial Complex that I want to go to in order to get to the wall. Fortunately, that also puts me back to full karma, but unfortunately, we did use the single, the passage, which is a single use per achievement. Okay, so that leads out of here. So we need to go left. I... I will admit, this is going to take a little bit of exploration because I don't actually know where we're going. Uh, you angry? They don't look angry. No, that's, that's a, uh. Oh, uh, yeah, they're angry. They're angry. They're angry. They're very angry. Screw you. Ah! All I did was try and walk through one of their gates. I even tried to give them spears and everything, and they just didn't care. Uh, what jerks. You didn't know those are scavengers. They're the jerks of the universe. I tried to be friends of them. They started it. Beginner's luck is over. Yes. Uh, we'll see about that. We'll see about that. No more streamer luck. Yeah. There's food up there. Can I get up there? There's like popcorn up there. Um, I can, but I have to do a fancy thing. Let's see if I can pull this off. <laughs> so yeah, you can throw your spears straight down, but apparently it wasn't good enough. Oh, wait, wait, maybe it was. I'm a god. I'm so good at this game. Ignore the fact that I just died two seconds into the video. Um, am I bad at this game? Can I not get up there from here? Well then. Never mind. Move on with our lives. Moving on with our lives. I don't need popcorn. Who needs popcorn? Popcorn's not even good. I don't even like popcorn. I actually don't like popcorn in real life. Based on where we are, I know we... We can try that direction. We're going to have to go places that I haven't been to before. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't you dare. I don't like this situation. Okay. They can't hit me if I'm above them. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Um, Let's try on the left side there. I think I can see a place where we can go up. 
I have PTSD of this zone right here because this is the first time when I was playing the first time I ran into those cloaking white of uh, white lizards. It looks like he's leading me to where I need to go. So we're not going to get too terribly lost. Unless it's spoilers, I um don't tell me, but uh what the hell is exploration mode? I kind of looked at it a little bit and it kind of looked like a roguelike. Like it was talking about like rewards and challenges and stuff like that. How do I get out of here? I think I can do this. Did I throw it too high? I threw it too high. Well, I guess I'm doing this way now. Um, That's a vulture. Don't mind me, sir. No, no, no. There was a second one. Are they eating each other? I don't know. You'll see their shadow before you see it like that. You know what? I'm going to go a different direction. I think I saw a worm. I want a green, too. We got this. I don't think that green one can get to me. The white and the blue can, though. They'll fight each other, right? Shit. Okay, maybe we don't go that way either. Oh, hey, look, food. Okay, we're gonna run past them. Ah, oh, shit, the blue's in the way. Come on, blue guy. Tasty meal right here. There you go. Why are you going back that You know what? Maybe I go with the vultures instead. Probably a way around, right? Like, I can just go around these guys. Well, not that way. No, no, no. No, no, no. Mm. <sighs> I'm good at video games. Okay, so if I do this instead. Look at that. that that's the part I'm going to leave in on YouTube. Just you watch. YouTube will never know. You'll never know. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No! <laughs> there we go. Got a... I like that this right here forces you to know how to wall jump before you can get up here. Meaning that, like, because this is not a true Metroidvania in the, the fact that you don't, like, gain any new skills or anything like that. But because it's not a true Metroidvania where you don't actually gain new skills, you just have to, like, gain skills yourself. Um, there's, like, skill gates of knowing how to do certain things. The screen shake, um, is, uh, it's, it's cool when it's cool and it's scary when it's scary. <laughs> also, best door animations in video games. Chimney canopy. I think there's a rest point nearby. Can I eat this? I can. Wait. Why did I just put that one inside me instead of eating it? That was concerning. Well, I'm going to have to figure out what this thing does now. Is it still alive? Did I keep it alive inside me? Everything in this game has a use. Everything does something. Um. Hear music. Oh, okay. So I think that might be a baby vulture. Um, this thing's really after me now. So it summons vultures. Vulture grub. Well, now we know. Apparently, I ate a whole bunch of vultures. I see you. Oh! Okay. Well, I died. I might have died four times already in the first uh, 23 minutes of this game, but I did get a new member out of it, so... Uh, I think I'm being rewarded. Is this sadomasochism? Sorry. Um... Uh... I could fight the vulture for the funnies. I'm failing to kill basic lizards. I don't think I have much of a chance against a vulture. 
Vulture Grub kind of like an airstrike? I mean, yeah. If I wanted to get rid of a whole bunch of lizards, I probably could have held on to that grub for a little while. If I knew what it did. And could have summoned it to take out a whole bunch of uh, lizards. Because the vultures and the lizards definitely don't like each other. Do it. It looks like there's only food over here, so... No, no, no! What the hell? What the hell? Come on! Scavenger? There's scavengers right nearby? St save me? Nope. No, don't... don't you... Yeah... Angry music's playing. I don't think they like me. No, no, no! It's hard for them to throw spears above them. So as long as I stay above them... I'm... More okay. It looks like that one right there, this transition right below me, is going to take me where I need to go. If you're new to Rain World, we need we need food. We need at least the four bars on the left in order to sleep. Um, and then the three on the right are what we will get um kind of like spare. And then that thing that I just ate, um, it will prevent me from losing karma next time I die. Not if, but when. Just a vulture casually eating a, a lizard. It means he has nothing to need that he needs from me. Hmm, that music though. Ooh, that's a shiny gem. I, if I give that to the scavengers, they'll probably like me a little bit more. Go ahead and. Oh, I still have the grub. Um. Eat. Guess there wasn't anything up else up here for now. Come on. I believe in you, Blue. What the hell is going on with that white one over there? He's having like a disco raid. Nope, no, 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 no. I love how he's just like, you can't see me. You've never seen me. Oh, yes! That was badass. Screw you. Screw you. Goodbye. There's so many lizards around here. What the hell? Why? I, I... No! No! What? What? Dude, stop camping. Okay. Just trains passing in the night. Well, we got our little death sign back, so we're protected from trauma loss again. This is no joke. This is like lizard home. Okay, we're gonna wait for him to get close. That's a vulture! Oh my gosh! I saw the shadow over behind me. No! What the- what the hell? Ah, oh, shit. Um... I believe they call this a rock in a hard place. Hit his head? We need to hit his body. Ah, oh, shit. They're- they're trying to pincer attack me. Okay. We got this. We got this. We got this. I like how he, like, reaches out to things nearby. Ah! Here we go. Hmm. I see you. <laughs> That's eight deaths.
in 30 minutes. Eight deaths in 30 minutes. What the? God. That was bullshit. <laughs> that one was bullshit. Okay. We're going to war. We're going to war. Get him! Get him! Yeah, run, you coward! Does it work twice? It does. We got another airstrike. This time I'm hoping to be able to pick it up before, uh... The Vulture. It's about how far we've made it each time now. Airstrike's going away. I'll put it away for now. I don't see any stealth lizards. I'm looking really carefully. Yeah, there we go. Murder them. Murder them all. That's what I thought, little white lizard. Yeah, there's more vultures coming, isn't there? Screw you guys. <laughs> I really want that grub. I what are you doing, dude? Go, let's go. Man, going in airstrikes is like is like the tactic here. Uh, screw you. Oh. I hear it. I hear a lizard. I don't see it, though. It's really close. That's really loud. Where? Oh. Do you see it? It's right above me. Well, I got one hit off on me. Okay, I'm going to be using something brave. Oh, yeah! Screw you, jerkwad, trying to camp me. There we go. Jeez, some. Um, I think this one goes up. Oh, hey! There we go. Oh, man, that feels good. I can't believe I made progress. Oh, so many deaths in a row, too. Aww. Wow. I didn't realize that I died so many times that I got down to minimum karma. That's going to be a problem. We're going to need more karma if we want to get out of here. Also, I just noticed rainbow. Um, which way do I want to go? I think I want to go right. There's a lot of procedural things in this game. It's funny. I don't know a lot about the actual game world itself. I mean, I don't know a lot about, like, the the gameplay itself, but I do know a lot about the game world because I watched this documentary about how the game is made. And, like, there's so much stuff that happens in this game. It actually has one of the most complex ecosystems that's ever been, like, made in a game. And, and in some cases, it's one of the most complex ecosystems that ever been made in any simulation. Um, like... Even, like, the sound that they make is procedural generation based on all of the different things that are on screen. It's really cool. Yeah. I I've watched a documentary about it, but I haven't beaten the game. <laughs> so, like, I know a lot of weird stuff about the world and the lore and how it was built, but I don't necessarily know, like, how to beat it or play it. <laughs> I don't need to be over here. Apparently, Azale really likes this game. <laughs> and then, Nulip, you said that the lore is even more interesting? I would believe it. So, like, one of my favorite genres, I don't know if anyone has watched the channel long enough to hear me say this about a million times, but one of my favorite genres is, like, it's a combination of things, right? So, I really love alien worlds. I really love sci-fi. And I really love the combination of, like, 
old alien worlds that have their own rules, right? So good examples for this would be like VA Proxy did it. Um, Kenshi has that going on where like the world is so alien that it has its own rules and it kind of eschews the normal rules that we're used to. And sometimes it can be because of an apocalypse, but it doesn't have to be because of apocalypse. And it happens a lot in sci-fi and it's literally one of my favorite things. But this didn't lead me somewhere I... Was there a way out of there that I'm missing? No. It looks like that was just like a little food sanctuary. Techno Buddhism nihilism. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. From what I understand about the lore of this game, the only piece that I do know is that um, whatever race created everything you're seeing, they sort of... Um, without giving away too much about how this game ends, because I do know that, um, I do know a little bit about that. The people of the world are all gone, but it's not necessarily for a bad reason. It's not an apocalypse, I'll say. Not a traditional one, at least. They, uh, that's a good way of putting it, Zeo. They, uh, left. Let's just say they left. How do I get that? Let's get that real quick. Okay. He does not give a fuck about the spear. Ho, ho, ho. There we go. That is... Oh, hey, a sandbot skin for vultures. I guess we go this way, because I don't know how to get back out of here. Okay, so... I don't have anywhere up to go. What? You fucking asshole! I was reading the map! Oh, look at that. There's a way up. So let's go that way. And then up. I was watching my video back just yesterday of my stream last time. I think I said the word up like 65 times. I said the word up so many times. Which is funny because I never actually went up in the actual video. I was in no danger whatsoever. I think I need to go to the left one here. Screw you! Screw you! Haha! Okay, I actually know where I am right now. There is a rest off to the left here. As long as I can get to it. Oh, I almost didn't make that. So we're gonna rest here. Yeah, I don't I didn't want to admit this, Azale, but I'm going to. This is my purgatory, too. This is where I quit last time. Because I got stuck here for so long. But the reason I got stuck was actually behind. I was behind one of these karma gates, and I couldn't get high enough to get back out. Uh, give me a second. Screw you. Oh, I got him right in the face. Man, that guy takes a lot of spears to kill. No, 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 no. I guess the mass doesn't work on the vultures. I guess... Why would it, right? Um... Am I trapped down here? No, I'm not. There's a thing right here. Oh, uh, Feels bad, man. I had a mask, too. I don't know what those do, but everyone just seems to be really excited that I had a mask. I hear vultures. Let's get moving. See if we can get out of here before they get here. Nope. No, no! You jerk! I was... I mean, I guess I was trying to do the same thing to him. No, I do not know who Pebbles is. I assume that's probably who I'm trying to get to see. Because I know I need to go and see someone that's like Moon. I saw the images. 
Okay. We finally have this area to ourselves for just a split second. I spoke too soon. What? I... I will admit that one was surprise. I didn't know what was going on and I died. Fucking hell. Okay, okay. We got this. Just need to calm down and play correctly. Oh. Going. I'll just add this to my mass collection, you assholes. I feel like, like, some sort of, like, happy jester dancing away with this man's mask. So, uh, correct me if I'm, if I'm, if I'm wrong. Can't I leave this mask in this, in this rest place now? And as long as I, like, it'll stay here for a while, right? We're gonna leave that mask in that shelter, because I want to collect masks now. Yeah, it shows the mask in the shelter, too. That's really cool. Hee 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 hee. Hit him in the head. There should be a name for that. Wahaha. My mask. <laughs> uh, nice. No shit, no shit. I was looking at chat. <laughs> they get more aggressive when you take their mask. I mean, I do too. Is it? Is that the weather? It's like a different color out. The saturation's been turned down. So there's something going on here then, huh? This is why you told me the rest? Well, I want to see what's up here. I've been trying to get up here for like, uh, no joke, like 20 minutes now, so... I feel like I have a bit of an opportunity to do so. Jeez, I, I don't know why I keep messing that up all of a sudden. Yeah, yeah, sure. Ah! Well. Vulture fall. That's, 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 that's what happened. Do I get to keep my mask at least? I do get to keep my mask. Hell yeah. That's progress. I don't care what people say. That's progress. Mine. <laughs> oh, look. Oh, I'm going to have to rest after this. Oh, hi there. I got two spears and a rock in that guy. Three spears and a rock. You're not having a good day. Bird murderer. I, I looked away from chat for just a long enough to come back to vulture killer bird murderer. I like mask collector. Has a kind of a bit of a hollow night ring to it. Okay, I hate to be going back and forth to the same area, but I am actually going to rest real quick. Mostly because people in chat just keeps telling me to over and over, so I'm guessing I'm missing something important here. Plus, if I rest, that second um, mask that I have now in there will be saved. I'm just going to uh, deface the entirety of the vulture population. I would say that um, if you want to get into Metroidvanias, like Hollow Knight is, Hollow Knight is one of the best ones to start with as well because it kind of like starts off at a low. It does this really cool thing with its pacing. I actually thought it was too hard, or, or sorry, too easy for most of my first playthrough, um, and then it's just like the game just like slowly paces. Anyways, it slowly paces out the combat in such a way that like you. You sort of like, I mean, it's still a Metroidvania, right? So you get new abilities and stuff like that, but you learn the game a little bit faster than the game gets harder. So it has really nice accessibility because of that. And despite really liking challenging games, I actually like accessibility in games too, because it means that more people get to play them. And then what I like is I like games to be as hard as you make them out to be. I mean, like they can be harder or easier based on how you play them. And that's something I'm, I'm a huge fan of. That's a white worm. I've died like a million times up here. I think I might stop dying to that. And we're going to just go right. Oh, 
Uh, that looks scalable. Yeah. Easy peasy. Zo is the stuff of nightmares. I think about Zo in my dreams sometimes. I probably don't have enough karma for this, do I? What symbol is that? That is... I think that's three. Yeah. Oh, hey! <laughs> he, had, he does have a vengeance for me. That's so cool. That's the guy I stole the mask from earlier. And he, has, he still has a spear in him. Four. Okay. So I need karma level four. Dude. 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 <laughs> he does not like that I stole his mask. Holy crap. <laughs> that man was for out for me. Oh, you're... You're back. This is really teaching me how to long jump. Consistently, though. Slide jumps are a game changer. Okay, I'll have to practice it. Oh! Look at that! That was cool. Okay, I get it, I get it. Oh, I can roll after a slide jump? Ooh. Okay, so that would be down jump into... Down and so down jump into jump into down left and then I can jump back out of that. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit to get used to, but uh, we'll, we'll practice that tech anytime we're moving. We're just gonna practice it while we're moving. We're not gonna like sit here and and lab it out. I'm also not going to practice it in places where I could hilariously fall to my death while practicing a movement tech. What? Did you guys see that? He literally pushed me out of the hole to kill me. This place is cursed. We've added, we've updated the goal list, okay? This jump being right here is the worst thing ever. Morning skill check. Yeah. Got him. <laughs> I don't know what, what you guys are talking about. I think I'm making progress. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're not going to we're not going to take it all the way back. We are. I rolled. Should I just leave this area? Is that what I should do? I mean, this is like my hyperbolic training the training chamber. I'm getting really good. I have, I have a straight up please in chat. Yes, please. Okay. That lizard straight up ran from me. He's so scared of me, I literally pulled the spear out of him. Hey, did he just kill my first lizard? Okay, we've never checked down. I'm gonna go down super fast, just... Apparently there's nothing down there. I was just gonna check to see if there's anything down there. Oh my god. <laughs> you don't understand. First goal is exploration. Yeah. I figured that was going to happen. I was too out in the open there. I mean, I could head back to what I know about. But it's very far away. Triggering is definitely a word for it. I don't actually feel triggered yet, though. I just, um... I keep making small mistakes. And I'm getting horribly punished for it. At this point, we unfortunately died 13 more times over the course of the next two and a half 
half hours. And despite the how much I would actually love to show you that footage, it, it's mostly just us dying in this one zone. Some funny things happened, and during that time, we did find out that that vulture is in fact stalking me. His name is Reggie. We have named them now. We don't really know their gender, so we're gonna go with they, them, but I technically default to his for like literally anything, including inanimate objects. So if you hear me call him him, it's just my natural, you know, speaking patterns. But uh, there's going to be a montage of all of my deaths going on in the background. And if you want to see it, there will be a VOD in the description below. Feel free to go over there and check it out. Otherwise, we did eventually make it out of hell. We made it to the wall and uh, we went ahead and rested there. Holy shit on a biscuit. This will go down in permanent memory for me. So I'm going to find a rest. As in this one right here. Ah, shit. Okay, we're going to find food. Oh. Okay. This has been Rain World, and I have been Arima. I hope you guys have enjoyed the episode, and if you have, feel free to leave a like, comment, and or subscribe. The editing that goes into these is far above and beyond what I do for any other video on my channel, and I'd like to do more of this, but it doesn't really pay off that heavily, so liking, subscribing, all that stuff really does help out way more than you think. It also is how you would get more content like this in the future. Anyways, I hope you have a good day. And goodbye.